Hello grade 5, in this video we are, going to, we are going to talk about the corresponding angles. So what are the corresponding angles? How can we test for the corresponding angle? Just remember the letter F. Corresponding angles, two angles that occupy corresponding positions. فإذا بنقول عنهم corresponding angles لما يكون في عندهم نفس الموقع المتشابه corresponding positions. So إذا بنلاحظ بهيدا الرسم في عندي top left and top left. فإذا خلينا نشوف this point of intersection and this point of intersection. فينا نحكي with respect to this point عندي top left okay and top left فإذا this angle and this angle are corresponding angle top right and top right so these two angles are corresponding angles bottom left so bottom left and bottom left so this angle and this angle we could say that they are corresponding angle again we have bottom right this angle and bottom right this angle and they are corresponding angles so the corresponding angles in this figure are 1 and 5 1 and 5 we have also 2 and 6 we have 3 and 7 and we have 4 and 8 so these are the corresponding angles in this figure find the measure of the missing angle so we have to find the measure of this angle as we see here that this angle and this angle are corresponding and the two lines are parallel then the corresponding angles are equal and the measure of this angle is 145 degrees so this is how we check for the corresponding angle this is the F test as we see here there is an F also F again there is the letter F and the letter F in different orientations which angles are corresponding so the angle 1 is corresponding to this angle 2 the angle 3 with this angle 4 and then 5 with this angle and 7 with this angle so these are the corresponding angles in this figure calculate the missing angles of the figure so we have to calculate all the angles in this figure so as we see here this angle and this angle are at the same position they occupy the corresponding position so they are corresponding angles so this angle is 50 degrees this angle is supplementary for 50 so it's 130 this angle here is vertically opposite for 50 so it's 50 or we could say that it's supplementary with 130 this angle is 130 since it's vertically opposite with this angle or we could say it's supplementary with its supplement is 50 or its supplement is 50 so it's 130 and then the other angles are corresponding so this angle is corresponding with this angle it's 130 at the same reason this is 50 and this is 130 so we could solve them like this supplement of 50 is 130 supplement of 100 uh, this angle is supplement of 130 it's 50 this angle is supplement of 50 or vertically opposite angle with 130 and those are the measure of the angles this angle is corresponding with this one it's 130 at the same time this angle is also corresponding with this angle it's 50 also it's corresponding with this one it's 130 and finally this angle is corresponding with this angle and it is 50 
so also we could use the alternate property we have here this angle and this angle are alternate they both equal 50 degrees and also this angle and this angle are alternate as you see the Z shape so they are equal 130 each one 